Yeah, man. So I'm going to be doing a, a live stream. Going to be raising some money. So I'm going to be doing a live stream from uh, my plan for now is nine to four. So it'll be a seven hour live stream and I'm going to be raising uh, money for the the Wooly Warriors project. So all the donations that are sent to that that live stream are going to be going directly to the Wooly Warriors project. Uh, it won't be that same day. I got to wait till I get paid, obviously, but I'm going to take a screenshot. I'll post it on Twitter. Everybody can see. And then when I send it, I'll post a screenshot on Twitter. YouTube as well, and uh, that'll all go towards the Winnie Warrior Project. And every thousand dollars that is raised, I will match with my own personal one hundred dollars that I'll be putting towards the Winnie Warriors Project. So just trying to put money into a good cause. Um, I've got a lot of respect for the military. I, I've got nothing but good things to say. My dad was in for twenty four years. Wow. Uh, he had his leg blown off in Afghanistan. He had to put a, a stimulus, like a stimmy, in his back so he could shock the pain that he had from some nerve damage. Um, and I, I, I feel that and I just want to get back to people. So if I can use the platform, YouTube, talk about stocks for seven hours, business, entrepreneurship, right? Whatever it might be, help some people out. You know, that's, that's what it's all about, man. Well, I know for a fact that I'm going to be donating, uh, and helping you out with that stream tomorrow. So if you guys uh, have not yet checked him out, that is going to be where we are going to be tomorrow. And, uh, and a quick question, do you have plans on sticking long-term with uh, uncle Ben, like your dad, or do you want to be like, uh, like ghost says in the chat, the young Elon Musk can take your millions and go somewhere else. You know, I was in and out of a lot of meetings uh, yesterday, and I can't disclose what they were about. They're pretty stressful. I'll say that. Um, I don't think I'm allowed to talk about it. Okay. I'm going to err on the side of caution and say I don't think I'm allowed to talk about it. Um, Didn't mean to ask you about something that you weren't you're not supposed no, to talk about. But no, you're good. I would, normally I would have. I would have before yesterday, but I have to be ultra, ultra careful about what I say at this point. I don't think I could talk about it. But what I can say is, that uh, I'm not going anywhere on YouTube. The attendees will be reinvested back into the channel. And I plan, I've got some big plans, man. I'm gonna keep giving back and find ways to uh, improve the investing community. Man, I'll tell you what, I don't know what your main goal is with your channel. Uh, I, I, you're doing good things and I know you're gonna continue to do good things. My main goal of my channel is to broaden the audience of the market and show people that you can be just a regular Joe Schmo weeb who likes anime <laughs> and, and tattoos and cracking and invest in the market and make money. We were raised to believe that if you, the only way you can make cash is if you put money in your 401k or your, or, or your Roth or give it to someone that can manage it for you. And then you'll, you'll be okay. You can retire when you're 65. Man, that sounds dumb. When I'm 65, I'm probably going to be in a wheelchair. I want to <laughs> retire and live a good life when I'm young. And the market's a way to do it. So if we can teach people to, you know, to do that, to play the long-term game with short-term aggressive strategies, you know, that's what it's all about. Just broadening the audience, getting younger people into the market uh, and showing good strategies so that we can build our portfolios and, and make a better life for ourselves. Because I tell you what, two years ago, I lived out of my car, back of my car, eating freaking bananas and ramen noodles, down $30,000 in debt. My credit cards were all maxed out with all my stupid health issues going on. And I changed everything because of, uh, because of the market. And if other people can do that, if I can do that, I am not that smart of a dude. Anybody can do that hundred percent. So that resonates with me so, so hard. And for some reason, like it's, that just makes it so down to earth, your kind of message right there. Um, when I like, I won't be gushing as much cause I don't have anything prepared, but I will say that it resonated me right here in the immigrant where I, where I, my parents definitely didn't want me to take any computer science classes. Didn't let me take any finance classes. Uh, it was just only like biochemistry and, and math. And that's all I had. None of that's useful now. Uh, I, I want every Everyone to know that no matter what kind of background you're from, if you look like me, if you look like Trey, if you look like none, neither of us, that the market is right there. And it's something that I barely got to learn until grad school. Uh, and that's something that really means uh, that if we can broaden that audience, if we can help people figure out passive income, uh, personal finance, and learning about exactly what parts of the market work for people with specific types of capital and what doesn't, I think that that's a fantastic journey to go on together. That's why I'm so glad that we're talking right now. We're just like two peas in a pod right here. Dude, heck yeah, man. It's crazy how the world works. Who would have thought, I'll tell you what, a year ago, I would have never thought I'd be having this conversation with you. A year ago, I thought I'd be in Korea by now. <laughs> but, but here we are uh, oh, having man. this conversation and doing great things. And man, that, that resonates with me too, man. I, I I think you're doing great things for yourself and keep grinding, dude. I It's it's really awesome to watch your channel. And uh, I didn't know you were an immigrant until now. That's that's really cool, man. And it's, it's something that everybody can do if they want. I mean, everybody, not everybody starts on the same, the same pedestal, right? Some people get a head start, but that doesn't mean that you can't do something if you work hard, you know, and you're obviously an example for that. So good, good things, man. That's awesome. I really appreciate that.